hey guys what's good how you doing i hope you are doing well welcome to vinyl tv if you are new to this channel and if you are please consider subscribing thank you very much indeed for stopping by thank you very much indeed for clicking this is hp mv 4527 to be precise this printer is multifunctional printer multi-tax or triple in one if you like in the sense you can copy scan and print from this gear this printer is connected to wi-fi network this printer is also dual band you can connect it via wi-fi or usb cable i just want to mention unfortunately usb cable is not included in the packaging you can get the usb cable at vinetech.store vinetech.store okay it's free delivery here in united kingdom okay we send it to your home address it's tested i'm going to turn this printer around and show you some of the stuff this is the power cable the power cable goes right here the usb cable goes to this spot i have the usb cable at home and also i'm going to put up a link how you can get the usb cable so this section goes right in here okay and this flat section go to your pc once you connect this to your pc it will recognize this printer automatically and you don't need much okay you don't need to worry about setting up the wi-fi and the function will work okay from right here this printer here is the scanner you stick your document on top of the scanner okay your passport or anything you want to copy or scan you stick it on top and select the function from right here once you connect this printer properly and everything is ready it, it, it will show you the screen here okay show you the copy scan and printable okay right now you turn this printer on and off from right here okay this printer like i said is using also 302 ink once you open it up right the ink will, will come right in the middle if you have any paper jam okay you check over here this is where to check you remove all the paper okay and make sure you close this you will hear a click sound okay so you need to adjust there's two arrows so you hold this together okay and go back in okay you will hear a click sound for you to know that it's closed okay now make sure you close this right back and also once you check at the back you can also bring out the paper tray Okay, once you bring the paper thread you also check over here for any paper jam okay i'm going to close this paper tray okay right now right now do you load any paper thread click yes okay right now the next thing i want us to do is basically to scan a document okay for you to scan a document okay i have a book here i want us to to show you for how to scan document passport anything at all stick your document on top of the scanner so and select the function you want okay basically we go to the app okay so right now we go to want us to go back to hp smart app okay this printer is ready this is the hp app okay from the app you can see instant ink printable shortcut mobile fast camera scan help and support print photo print document print task scan copy okay so what we need to do is click printer scan okay right now it's asking us create account or sign in okay right now asking us connecting to hp service so we need to sign in to the hp okay so right now i'm going to put the password for my hp account for us to be able to sign in What I'm doing right now is signing into my HP account. Right now, 
I've signed into my HP, okay, it's telling us wait patiently. It's transferring the information. Okay, allow. Right now, here you go. It's starting to print a scan. Okay, once you select printer scan, the next thing you can do is if you want to see preview, fetch preview, then you select preview. Now this will start okay scanning the document we have here right now is scanning. Okay, so with fetching preview, if you're happy with it, here we go. This is very fast and quick. Okay, scan has been sent very fast. So if you're happy with it, then you click scan. If there's anything you want to change or adjust okay you can actually adjust this to the particular size you want okay so but this is the essence of fetching preview for you to see if there's anything you want to change okay here is this what the preview looks like then you select scan right now it's scanning this document very fast okay that this job is done if you want to do the second page okay the next thing to do is turn it around okay turn it upside down close the printer okay from the app click plus you can see the plus okay the next thing you need to do is also click scan the same procedure very fast okay so this job is now complete this is the first one this is the second one okay if you want you can we can print out this document with scan okay we can print it out straight away or you share this document from the bottom here you can see print share shortcut or save okay what i want us to do is basically print this document okay and once you print this document, then we send it or share this document, then I'm print out. So I'm going to click share. Click share. Now, once you click share, you select the format. JPG is usually for photo. PDF is, usually, is for documents. So right now it's on PDF. You can, the actual size is 1.0 MB. You can actually adjust the size to medium. If you adjust it to the medium, it will be easy for you to send. Okay. Then the next you need to do is click share. Once you click share, it will bring out platforms for you to select the one you want. So we have email, WhatsApp, Yahoo Mail, Print, Bluetooth, Wi-Fi Direct, Safe to Drive, Message. So I want us to send this to Message. I mean email. Right now, this document is attached to my email. I'm going to put send it back to my in inbox okay i'm sending it back to myself the next thing we need to do is put a subject and click send right now it's asking us send with no no subject click send okay right now this document is sending it's sent off and once it's finished the next thing we need to do is you can go back and print this out okay or you go back to your inbox and print it from your email so to print this out you just need to click print okay once you select print it will start to process okay right now we have this document right here you can print it black or color if you want to print it black you select black okay and it will change to black then you select print right now is printing out we'll print out two pages black black color okay and once this black finish i'll also show you how to print color as well
fine texture beautiful stuff okay this is the first one very beautiful fine texture okay this is black I just want to mention also if you change your mind okay and don't want to you just press this X here and it will stop printing okay here we go beautiful stuff well, so we printed this document black okay right now and also it's telling you here wait for the printer to finish before you put okay so right now it's finished if you want to print color the same procedure select print okay and once you select print okay now you select color make sure from the color setting color mode you select color if you want it to print i want us to print this two-sided okay the next thing we need to do is click two-sided print okay select two-sided okay so right now this document will print colored and it's two-sided okay so select print Okay, right now it's going to turn for us to print the two sided. Okay, here we go. now finishing printing here we go this is the two-sided printing with two-sided okay you, you save paper okay so what we have done right now we scan the document print it out black and white also print it out two-sided and also print it out 
color and also we share this document we send it to my inbox so right now i want us to go to my email and look for this document okay so right now i'm going back to my email this document is right here inside my inbox okay click it download and once you click download you can actually print it from your email okay so right now it's downloading click it open here we go this is a document inside my inbox Thank you very much guys if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe share this video like and share it will help us to grow thank you appreciate you thank you